Hi. Please try to ignore the fact that I'm very over lit right now and if I move you can see the ring light in the mirror. I'm sorry but I'm not that sorry because I can't really be asked to move anything. Um, I'm just going to start talking so here we go. I hate when people start their videos with loads of apologies so I'm not sorry. You can just deal with the ring light and you can deal with the mess as well. You're welcome. I'm here today to moan about this cardigan. So this this is it. Uh, what it basically is is a huge cardigan. I've been working on this project for a while but I keep having to stop because it's just kind of fucked. Uh, I'll explain why in a minute. I'll put it on as well and show you. I might get my boyfriend to like model it so you can see how it hangs. It's way too big for me whilst also somehow not being big enough. I haven't been following a pattern. I just like saw it in my head and imagined how it would work. And I saw a photo, which I'll throw up now, of a crocheted cardigan. The person wearing it is very, very small and it's much, much smaller than anything I would have made. But I was inspired by that, so I tried to take that and make my own cardigan. It didn't really work. I'm gonna do the best I can with showing you. Uh, we're gonna keep it real on the channel. I'll just literally stay filming while I move this and show you. This will show you the top half. I'll show you like the whole thing from a distance in a sec, but this is basically what we're working with. Uh, I have no idea, yeah, you can kind of see. So this is like the top half. Um, and yeah, this is not a good shot. Okay, stay right there. I believe in myself. We're gonna make it work. I'm gonna show you. Uh, my messy hallway. Okay, I think you can see, like, you can probably see enough. Uh, this is the cardigan, um, so oh, it looks like this. Um, <laughs> this is the huge giant sleeve, um, which is just stupid. It's like stupidly big. Um, it literally, you could fit like seven arms in there. Um, this needs a lot of work. So this is what I mean when I say it's like too big whilst simultaneously being too small. Like, it's too uh, small because I can't pull it closed like that like it doesn't it doesn't properly close but it's too big because if I leave it hanging it's like ridiculously long which I, I hope you can see like I don't really know what you're seeing right now but it goes down to like the back of my ankles almost the whole thing is just an absolute fail and it's so big and slouchy uh <coughs> not COVID I still have loads more to do so I need to add obviously this sleeve so I'm gonna do a big hood and I'm gonna like try and like work it out but the more I add the more hours have gone into it and the more time that goes into it the more I want it to be good but the more I add the bigger it gets and the shittier it gets so I don't fucking know what to do here's like the back of it um so this is the back kind of panel but it's not really a panel it's just like one wide thing before you say what I was thinking which was to just turn it into a blanket I can't turn it into a blanket because I've crocheted it to itself um un, like not flat so i crocheted the back and the side and the front all around this hole to make a sleeve so i can't turn it into a blanket because it will just be a really odd shape i'm really disappointed because it doesn't look right <laughs> and it just doesn't work as what it's supposed to be but i also like kind of love it because i love the pattern um but sadly it just it's not my best work what i think i'm gonna do is finish the other sleeve and then i'm gonna crochet the hood um, basically, I'm going to finish it, but I'm going to finish it as well as I can based on what I have um, and hopefully it comes out looking okay. If you crochet and you have any ideas as to how I can save it, please, oh please, message me on Instagram. My Instagram is at RachelThePython. I'll be very appreciative if you have any expertise or ideas of like how I can make it acceptable. Um, I accept already that it's going to be huge and massive, but I don't really mind that as long as it's like cosy because this is the first like piece of clothing I've ever tried to crochet. Inevitably, it's not gonna be that good, but if you like send me ideas for hoods, it might help me um, to not make something terrible. I want it to have like a big hood. You know, like the hoods that the Volturi have in the last Twilight movie. I want it to be like that, like really big, like Volturi, but make it crochet. I can't remember the lady's name and I can't check because my phone is filming, but I want to say a massive thank you and shout out to the lady who crocheted my hexagon blanket from my hexagon blanket video and sent me a picture of the blanket um, on my Instagram. It looks so good. Please, if you ever crochet my hexagon blanket, send me a picture because it makes me so happy. I sent it to all my family. I was like, guys, this lady crocheted my pattern. I was gassed and I felt low-key famous, so love that. Anyway, I'm gonna go and carry on working on this. Wish me luck. Also, how cute is this makeup I did to go and see my grandma? I put it on this morning at like 8 a.m. So I'm very oily. Thank you all very much for watching. I love you guys loads and I will see you when I see you. Bye.